Oh, what the f What am I doing? Welcome to Martha is Dead. All right, a new horror game that I've been looking forward to for a very long time. All right, start. And let's see what this game is all about. I don't really know much about this game, honestly. I've tried to avoid it. Uh, image to the, on the left is barely visible. Okay, we could turn it down a little. Apply. But I know it's based in like... Oh god, now I can't remember. It was like 1940s or 1930s or something. But that's about it. So Martha's Day's feature characters work on fiction. The game contains potentially... Yep. Meant to be a pretty brutal game, I've heard. Alright, continue. Alright, resource. Uh, continue. Here we go. I'm ready. Oh. Hi. Ciao. I'm Julia. Hello. Julia K. I'm glad you are here. Nobody has visited me in ages. It's been years now. I must tell you my story, but I don't know where to begin. There is so much that I should start from my childhood. All right. The memories of these times are vague. I only remember the summer of 1929 when they sent me off to stay with my nanny. Are we going to do stories? Oh, here we go. Here we go. New chapter, The Legend, Summon, oh, 929. So we're going to go through stories she tells. Story of the White Lady? No, Little Sparrow, not tonight. A fog is coming, see? Yes, I know that when it's foggy, the lady kills young women. But why is she so evil? You see, Julia, pain and suffering can make us do evil things. Mm -hmm. Even if we're not actually bad. Just like soldiers had to kill other soldiers. I like the lady I've decided, Nanny. She must be in so much pain. The poor dear. She still scares me a little, though. Soon I'll be a young woman, and she could kill me. Does she kill those who love her? Of course. What are we talking about? Oh, God. Me feel better because I love her. Uh huh. But what about Martha? Would she be in danger? Your sister is with your mother, so do not worry. Do you miss them? No. I mean, yes. I miss Martha a little. Mm. I love spending time with you. Now, go to sleep, little sparrow. It's getting late. Okay, Nanny. I'll go to sleep and dream of the lady. Oh, God. What's the lady? She was beautiful. Yes. Very much so. Then she'll be beautiful in my dreams. And will I be beautiful just like her? You'll be even more beautiful. Listen, Nanny. Since the lady won't harm me because I love her, and since you're not a young woman, could you tell me her story? All right. Even if it's foggy outside. Please. Story and story. Then I'll sleep. I promise. Oh, all right. You always get your own way. Yep. I guess. You are. Okay, another... <laughs> I loved Nanny and I loved that story. Every time I heard okay, it, it sounded like a new and more mesmerizing tale. Every night I would ask her to tell me about it, even though it scared me. Mm. Even now I can remember every single day of that time and how happy I was. Oh, here we go. To move the camera. According to an ancient legend. Oh, well, here in the story. Haunted by the spirit of a young woman who was killed by the man she loved. Oh. She was expecting a lover the lady the lake, gazing out at the old tree growing on the lake's island. Yes. So much hope and desire, but death, not love, was awaiting her. Oh, speak up, keep listening. Oh, we got decisions like this? Speak oh, up. The poor dear. That's not fair. Life isn't fair, Poppet. But that's the way it is. And we must learn to deal with it. Okay, I'll try. 
but it makes me so mad. Keep on reading, Nanny. Keep on reading. In despair, the man confessed he had killed her out of jealousy. Oh, that's good. What lovely story to listen to his little girl. In the middle of the very same lake where he had killed the girl. Huh? All oh, right. Yeah. Okay. He got hanged for killing her. Everywhere, but the girl's body was never found. Hmm. Since then, her spirit, known as the White, the White Lady, has been imprisoned in the depths of the lake. She grieves eternally for the loss. Oh God! Of she loved. Is this a true? No, not. Is it actually true? When fog arises, the White Lady is known to leave the waters of the lake and roam the woods, looking for her long lost love in vain. Within the fog of dawn, hunters have claimed to hear the wailing. Of course, of course they have. I could just keep speaking up. Scared of this story, even though I like the lady. Should I stop reading, my little sparrow? No, nanny. Nah. Daddy always tells me that. Keep listening to the horror story. Be faced. Go ahead. Okay, honey. Face the fear. What's next? Every time the sad memory of the night she perished stirs in her soul, she takes the life of a young girl. Oh, of course. By slaying such a life in its youth, even just for an instant, the lady feels free from the burden of her pain. You got... Oh! Good night, Nanny. So that was the story. Okay. Good night. I spent almost three years with the nanny, but when I came home, I quickly forgot how to be happy. My memories did not return until 15 years later. What? In 1944, when I stayed in that house. I enjoyed setting up cameras in the woods by the lake. My father created a device that attached to the cameras. It would make them take pictures at set intervals. So that you were going to be in? I don't know. Animals. Or whatever else was in that damned place. Huh. Oh, here we go. We're playing now. New chapter, The Lake. July 16, 1944, 6 a.m. Alright, uh, let's interact. Hold, and boom. So, taking some pictures. Take. Reel off the film. So, it's going to be like an interaction gear. So I really don't know, actually. Like, are we not going to be walking around? Open the camera. Remove the old roll of film. And boom! So what'd we capture? Is it on automatic? Oh no, we're putting something different. It's different in. Put the new film in. Um... There we go. Load the film. And we got the film in. Move. Yeah. Oh no, keep going. The timer. What are we looking at? To bring the image into focus. Come on, yeah, down. I'm doing it. There we go. There's something floating on the surface of the water. Huh? If I frame it better, I might be able to Oh no, what is it? Oh, it's a body. What? Is that a person? I must help them. Let's go help them. Oh yeah, I'm not it's like the game's automatically moving. Okay, so it's like an interaction game. I was horrified at the idea that someone might have drowned in my lake. Your lake. The lake was my well, where I would spend entire days daydreaming. And someone died there. Fantastic. 
was a rude awakening. So terrible. So what do we do? They die. Oh, what the hell? Oh, we're going into the water? Oh, here we go. Save him! Oh, swim. Okay, we are moving around. I'm coming! Who died? Is it Martha? That's what the game's called. Isn't Martha our sister? I instantly noticed that the person was wearing one of my dresses. I was scared. Mm. I dragged that lifeless body as best as I could. Sorry, us. I think so. Trying not to drown myself. Only when I lifted her in my arms did I realize who she was. It was my sister. Yeah. My twin. A, past a twin. Oh. Dead. Impossible to comprehend. I was desperate. I didn't know what to do or to think. Hmm. Oh to God. Say Okay, so. Not dead. Oh, well, I don't know about that one. Hello? It's Check the pulse. Possible. Obviously, we're telling a story, so we're calm. It's not true. Cause it just sounds kind of weird that we're calm, but it's a story we're telling. Right? There's no need to worry. But is she dead? We would have found out by now. Uh huh, what is that? Oh, a necklace? Martha. February 26th, 1923. Are we putting this on? Is everything okay? Oh. Hello? What are you doing? Sup, parent? My parents ran towards me. Yeah. My mother hugged me. She, who detested me, was now cuddling me. Don't, well, she didn't like you. Me with life, and the pain became bearable. I felt protected. Martha, are you okay? Um, she asked me, speaking slowly in order to let me read her lips. She thought I was Martha? She thought I was deaf. She thought I was Martha. I didn't want the moment to fade. So I meekly nodded my head. So you became Martha. Something that couldn't be undone. And now they think the other daughter, you're dead. I would have to pretend to be Martha. Oh my God. Forever. And Martha is deaf. So to pretend to be deaf. Jesus. New chapter, the body. Sign of the cross, get up. Well, what? I just moved really quickly. Um, sign of the cross. Oh, we're speaking. Let your sacrifice of love be offered for Martha. Can I let anyone hear me saying or talking? To your hands, I also entrust my spirit. Oh, it's a lag when I move. Reunited with her in perpetual light, to never suffer the desolation of purgatory. Please grant her eternal rest, O Lord, and may eternal light shine upon her. Mm-hmm. People will be here soon. Mummy always finds something for everyone to do. Well, you just called me my, my name. It can be disabled. Space to highlight point of angels. Well, I need to know how to play the game. Um, what's this? Whoa, I just went up to the books and pressed something. In our villa, there must be ten times more than even here. Hmm. The emperor. Hi. Daddy must be devastated. He loves me. I messed up and now I have to watch him suffer my death. I can at least light the candles and let him find some comfort in sleep. So who do they th so they think I'm Martha, but I swear they just called me the other name. I don't know. Daddy's oboe. We were preparing a really nice duet together. On the rare occasions he's at home, that is. Yeah, um... A telegraph box. I know how to use it. Daddy taught me. There's no reason to use the phone right now. Yeah, yeah. Can I light the candles?
And light. Boom. Like this. Okay, we're just lighting up all the candles for now. I feel like this game's gonna take a big turn at some point. When you're done, can you come and get the flowers, please? Or send Martha if you like. <sighs> Never a moment's peace. Even at a time like Send me, Martha. It's kind of dark. Daddy's canes. They are so beautiful, but I can't say why, but they have always scared me. Uh huh. Um, collect the flowers for mother before she gets angry. Gotcha. Riding bikes around here. Before, oh wait, we have a certain amount of time to do it. Daddy's bikes, though. Mine is outside. I'm coming. I'm coming through. Let's go. Everything always has to be perfect with her. Yeah. Oh, what's going on? Music. Why you get all like different? I don't know, it's talking different language. What do I do with the flowers? Do I put the other one oh, over here? Gotcha, gotcha. Alright, let's place the flowers. Uh, boom. Oh, doorbell. Hello? Who's there? What's happening? Who closed the door? What is this? Okay. Oh, I got locked in here. That's fantastic. Oh no, wait, why do I think my name was Eric? I, must have fallen asleep. I, I thought it was a girl's name for some reason. No, I guess I just. That's my father. <laughs> you can't what is. I don't even know what my name is. Oh, we're listening. No, no. I want to stay with my daughter. Your daughter? Your daughter? You have another daughter, you know. The one who's still alive. Jesus. Remember? What are you talking about, Irena? Julia is dead. Julia, that's my name. What kind of comment is that? How can Why does she never like me? You should be thinking about Martha. Julia harmed Martha. You know that, right? And as if that were not enough, she has now also abandoned her. It's the same old story. Jesus, she finds out I'm Julia. Julia's fault, isn't it? Her fault for Martha being deaf and for you being infertile. What? Do you think it's the right time for this? Julia is dead, Irena. Dead. Someone killed her. Did someone kill her or did she drown? Do you realize that? Of course I realize. I get it. Do you think I'm stupid? No one understands it better than me. She always brought problems. Only problems. It would have been better if she hadn't been born at all. You're crazy. Jesus. I'm the crazy one? Me? Okay. Um. We have done this to get at me. Yes. Your death is all my fault. All I could ever do for you was hurt you, Julia. My poor, sweet, crazy girl. What will I do without you? What will life be like now? All the time I didn't spend with you. But now I'm home. We can go fishing together. Mm. We can take pictures of butterflies. We must be like completely identical. No. We can't do anything together anymore. Can we? Nothing. I miss you. Julia, I miss you. Okay. I should start. Don't open your eyes. While American bombings continue to devastate the peaceful towns within the Elsa Valley, we have heard some tragic news from the area of La Ramola. The young daughter of German Army General Erich K was murdered near her. Oh. What 
possible oh wait uh, he's an army general this is what the carabinieri who immediately intervened hope to find out maybe she was killed who knows all right mother didn't seem to suffer from the situation all she cared about was that my death was so painful for Martha, but not having me around anymore must have been a great relief to her. At the end of the day, it that was, was better for everyone that it was me who died. Yeah, okay. And it was better for me too that people thought that. But the guilt began to consume me. That's when I started having horrible nightmares. Oh God, we're gonna be get one of those nightmares now. Yep, my eye. Oh, oh, Martha. Whoa, 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 whoa. Has lost. Oh, God. So? Jesus. That's our camera. Hi there. You don't have a face. Not real. Oh, do you? Kind of. Didn't look like that when you were far away. Oh my god. I I know what to choose. We'll give. <sighs> Wrong. Oh, we can only go one way. I got lucky the first time then. I stole her identity. Um, it's all a nightmare, right? Hey, Martha. Oh, what the f- What am I doing? Do I oh no. Do I have to do this? If I don't... Oh, oh. We're, we're taking off her face, aren't we? Oh, God. This isn't gonna... Oh, no. And this music that's playing. Whatever it is. Just instruments. Oh, God. Fantastic. Well, lucky we already look like her. Hi. What a great dream. <laughs> Bloody hell. Okay, now. Loading into somewhere else. It was just a dream. Just a dream. Horrible dream. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That horrendous woman and the face of my sister. I wish all of this was a dream and my sister is just sleeping in her bed. If I only. My bed is empty and this is reality. This is Martha and me at the festival of the patron saint. It was only a few months ago and now. Yeah. Um, okay. 
Martha had asked for a picture of me to put in this frame. That's a frame. That was a mirror for a sec. Is that a mirror? Looks like, like a mirror as well. Expressions that she couldn't quite imitate. She used to say that those were the signs of my soul. Can a photo capture the soul? Can I capture Martha's soul? Are we going to try? The camera. New chapter of the room. Okay. Uh, space highlight place of interest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I got that. I could always turn off hints. We'll leave it for now. Say the next one. It could contain something that will help to figure out what happened. So you want to figure out what happened? Uh, open. To me, wearing them will be like having her with me. Mummy will also be happy to see them. Or I could wear my clothes in the other wardrobe. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. Put on some white. The magician achievement. Okay. Um. Scary fairy tales. Everything seems to be scary lately. Yeah. Yet everything here is so beautiful and bright. Um. Okay. Eighteen. July eighteenth. Yep. I always keep my trinket box locked. Yeah, but where's the key? Oh gosh, if Mummy sees this picture, she'll throw it away for sure. It's me and Lapo. I want to see him as soon as possible so we can mourn Martha's death together. Oh, uh, well, I guess that's who you, your part, your partner. I still like to have the no, no, actually, partner, a boyfriend. With me. Maybe. Nanny will be visiting me soon. Oh. The butterfly collection that Daddy made for me. Mm-hmm. So we're going to have to tell our boyfriend the truth, obviously. Um, I don't want to leave yet. So these are my clothes. I'm already dressed. Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to. Um, is this to leave? I hope not. I need is always in my bag. No, I don't want to leave. Oh, open the bags. My key, yeah. You find objects that Julia always carries with her along with any picked up during the game. Objects are listed at the bottom left. Select, yeah, analyze it. Now try selecting the key or the map. The key to my trinket box. Yes. Open. What's in our trinket box? What's in Martha's there? Here is my diary. What's that? Okay. I look in our diary. July 12th, 19... Oh, I got a story. This is a new diary. We moved here today and I forgot my old one back at home. Oh. But that's okay. A new chapter in my life. A new diary. They say they brought us here for our own safety. Daddy, the war, and everything. Where's here? Nanny gave us her house and she went to look after the mansion. It's weird being back here after so many years. I remember Nanny telling me the fairy tale of the Lady of the Lake. It's one of the few happy memories I have from when I was little. Nanny isn't here and that's a shame, but Martha is here with me. I also get to see Lapo more often, which is wonderful. He's always hanging around here. Mum is thankfully too preoccupied with fixing up the house to worry about me. At least for now. Uh-huh. All right. Okay, we don't need to read lit. 16th, 19th. Oh, okay, it's only two pages. Okay, we'll, we'll listen, we'll listen. 16th, I was going to say, it was like heaps of pages. We'll just leave it. The woods. Every time I'm at the lake, I get a strange oh? feeling. Maybe it's the legend of the white lady playing tricks on me. I get Maybe. weird ideas. I think that there is this presence. Probably I is. I'm just being crazy. Martha, if she didn't drown, she died somehow. Else. Somehow. I'm not scared. In fact, I'd say I'm excited. I've made arrangements with Martha. She's coming to the lake with me tomorrow to set up two new cameras with timers, and we'll see what we can photograph. Is that when she died? A good swim, of course. Oh. To be honest, Martha doesn't like photography all that much, and recently she's no, maybe she's been swim too. Well, if she swims a lot, it's unlikely she drowned. By teasing me. Then, when she gets bored, she disappears into her books, and I do my own thing. We feel right when we're together. So, uh, she goes swimming a lot. She's probably in drown, right? I'll be right there. I'm just going upstairs to call Martha down for breakfast. Fine, but I'm not sure we Is this an unlock? That's not going to work. This is not the right key. What did you say? I must get her key if I want to know what's inside her trinket box. Yeah, do we know where her key is? I'm already awake. They really think I'm Martha and I can't hear them. Oh, yeah. 
She doesn't think we we can't hear. So that means uh, it should be yeah okay we can just hear conversations that they don't think we list can we can hear album log objectives camera okay I'm gonna start like doing things Julia likes to do me like take pictures and they'll be like why are you doing that it's about that's not like you so it's gonna be very interesting um. I can just say I'm trying to do things like she did because she's dead now. I don't know. Even if I, yeah. If I told them I wasn't Martha, who knows? Maybe they wouldn't even believe me. How wonderful the snow is. Unfortunately, it doesn't snow often around here. Eh, well. Oh, we got to go down for breakfast. Dad loves these prints of Florence. I find them a bit sad. Yeah, shift are unlocked. Lots of doors are locked. So yeah, bathroom. It's locked. Strange. Why did they lock my room? That's my room. I thought my we shared a room. There was two beds over in the other area. Maybe I had a different room. Martha's breakfast is ready. We can go. Yes, yes. It's getting late. Did you leave the newspaper for Martha? You know how much she likes reading it. Yes, Irena. It's on the table. Can't you see? And that camera, are you leaving it there? Yes, Irene. Can't you leave it there for a few more days? Do you mind? It was for you. I should just take it so they don't take it away. I will take it away soon. I, I promise. The sword makes me so sad. See if there is a seal. I don't know how to explain it. All right, all right, all right. But let's go now. We have too much to do. All right, well, they're leaving at least. Don't have to be worried about saying anything accidentally. Mommy is right, though. Martha always read everything. It's me who will now read the newspaper instead. They'll be out all day. If you Julia to take more and more photos. Everything is more complex with the war. Over the next few days, I will see little to nothing of them. Mm. Care to see the objectives? The newspaper. Yeah, yeah, read. Oops, read newspaper. What's in the newspaper, huh? Brutal assassination in San Cassiano. I don't actually have to read it. They're not gonna. It's not like they're gonna ask me about what's in the newspaper, right? Brutally murdered near her home. Carabinieri investigates. A possible political motive emerges. Martha was not killed by politics or war. She was killed by something much closer and much less. Oh, okay. I will find out the truth. Yep. Uh. Oh no, I read a lot. Alright, uh, here. Bullwick, even in the skies. So we're just reading this stuff. Well, they read for, at least you, I didn't have to read. <laughs> Game reads for you. Thank you, Julia. Enemy convoy lost in the Mediterranean. Two destroyers and six merchant vessels mm. sunk. Um, this one. Julia K. About me. Distressed but supported by faith. Irene E, the mother, Erich the father, and Martha the sister sadly announced Julia's passing. The funeral will take place in La Romola, Thursday, July 20th at 9.30 p.m., departing from the property of the deceased. Uh-huh. Um, and the First son. Hey, we're actually, like, reading this in our head, not our mind. <laughs> not out loud. ...increased by 50 grams per day as of April 20th. Just the headlines are reading. ...every month of soup ingredients reforms to the treatment of agricultural workers and an unexpected distribution uh -huh. of jam. Okay, uh, close. Can I take my camera? Um, what's this? Why can't I grab this stuff? Oh, there we go. Will I take this so they don't get rid of it? For Julia, to take more and more photos, Dad. Or just pretend it's gone. I can verify that the camera is still working by taking a photo. I could photograph oh. the sparrow. There are so many of them out here. Bread, butter, jam, and coffee. Martha's typical breakfast. I prefer honey and milk, but I will have to adapt to her tastes. Yeah, we can't really. There might be birds around. Go for anything in else. Front of the house. I always put crumbs on it for them. What else is around in this house? Gotta find keys and whatnot. Martha's stuff. 
Oh, but he has Jesus. You still because we haven't had the funeral. Um, what's on this? Florence, July fifteenth, nineteen forty-four. General Eric Pei. As per our prior agreement, we are sending you military encrypted communication material. The device must remain hidden and secret. Hail. Uh, I don't know. Feld Mascheralo, Carl H. I don't know what that device is. Not this thing. This is more like a radio. Oh! oh! Moments I thought I saw. Oh no, that's not possible. It must be this whole situation making me see things that don't exist. Um, let's not go down there yet. We've got a photo to take. Birdies! Uh, so where did I say I would put it? Try the camera. Take a photo in the gar the garden. That's what I said. We have a massive house. Mm. House is pretty big. Oh, here we go. Um, oh, here camera. You're about to use again the camera. It's a, from 1940 relic of 120 of fear. You take photos throughout the game. Some photos we have hidden elements that will progress the game's story. While holding the camera, an icon will appear to you to get photos of photographic interest. The icon will appear to become more close. You are. Press E. Observe the camera. No camera skin unlocked. Look at the subject you want and to continue. Q to exit. Okay. Take a photo. About to take your first picture. To simulate for try simulation, the picture preview displays the settings as you change them on your camera in real life. The viewfinder's image is controlled by the secondary lens and only response to focus. Uh, prepare yourself for the first picture. If you stand to be able to fine tune the camera rotation, pitch and height. Oh uh, yeah, gotcha. Open the advanced settings panel to make you unique. Oh my god, use panel to adjust focus to switch to the extras tab. Here you'll find all the cameras add-ons you'll be able to use different lenses of films. Damn. There's a lot to take in photos. Close to the windows, select the camera, press space to shoot. Got to take a photo where an important feature of the story hasn't been correctly framed. What? The story may not progress. No? I don't want to skip the tutorial. I think I got to take it. Congratulations, you take your first photo. You can choose many as you want throughout the game, but remember that only few will be critical to show his progress. Close. Okay. Um, weird. Try the camera. So I got to do that again, but I haven't like progressed the story properly. Well, you know what looked creepy? The basement. So we're going to go to the basement and see what on earth is down there. Hello. Is that blood? No, it's probably, it might just be the wine. Um, I'll take some scissors. These could be of use to me. Could be. Never know. Um. Mummy's medicine. Will they do her any good? Who knows? Uh, oh, oh. Sewing machine. She learnt how to sew because nobody else could do it to her liking. Don't like it, do it yourself. All right. Um. Boom. A letter. Lorenzini haberdashery. Five meters of grey cotton fabric. Six meters of white linen fabric. What's all this for? Four meters of green satin. Delivered on June 5th, 1944. In the event of an issue, contact us on the number 6987. And this red fabric? It's not been mentioned. Could this also be one of mummies, or could the nanny have left it here? Who knows, God. Photo room? Where we develop our photos? Daddy set up his dark room here. He doesn't take photos anymore because of his work, but photography is still his true passion. I'm allowed to use the dark room when I want to. That's why I like maybe learn photography from me, from him. I'm gonna learn how to do this. Maybe. There are three baths when developing photos: the development bath, then the first rinse, and then the fixing bath. The second rinse is done directly in the sink after. Turning a photo out to test the camera properly. 
Yeah, I've done that, but clearly I'm not meant to yet. I have to come here and develop the sparrow photo once I do it, but I need to do something else before I can do that. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing here either. What am I looking at? Oh, to offer you first have to use the in oh no, I have got the photo. First have to use the enlarger. The enlarger optical instrument allows you to process photographic paper. After shooting a photo, the film must be dialed in several steps. This actually is omitted to the sake of simplicity, but in reality, these steps are as follows. The film is firstly rolled on a reel and put inside a small tank. The tank is then impressed, immersed in a developer, washed, and then immersed in a stop bath. It is then washed again, dried, and finally cut. You'll find your rolls of film. Okay. Choose the image you want to print. Preview on the left side. You'll choose. Okay. Uh, it's the only one I have. Enlarge allows you to customize the photo even more. You can choose on which part of the photo paper which will be printed you can just focus and choose how long expose the photographic paper when the red field you can project you can project and see the image on paper without exposing it just controls to move the paper on the bench and adjust to make it film when the three circles are aligned the picture is focused if you still see the image out of focus when aligned you probably shot it that way play with adjustments so you're happy when you put oh god oops can't develop the photo like this. Right. So you just gotta like. When the red field is removed, the image is exposed in the paper. Oh, okay. Um Did we do it? Oh we Oh. Most of the paper in development's image will appear. To achieve the ideal exposure, take the paper out of the developer when the time is in the green zone. Too early to late, the picture will be ruined. Um, okay, how do we... So we got to wait for the... Oh my god, the green's pretty small. Got to do it. Perfect. A wash is stopped. The second wash did... Have been... Wait. Eat additional bar and skip for the sake of simplicity. All right. You print a photo, you keep it in your album or scrap you can these photo you can print these photos shots as many times as you like. Okay. Put an album? Why not? What's this? Daddy had this device bought here last week. It's old, but it still works. Why's the door shut? Always loved everything technological. Um, okay. What else is down in here? This creepy ass place. I can't really, I, I can't even see what's going on. Seemed enormous. I thought I could live inside one. Thought you could live inside of one. Um. Okay, I guess nothing else. So we're going to take a photo and uh, make a photo. But the story hasn't progressed yet because we're meant to do something else first. So to, to do with Martha. Do we have an objective? Try the camera. Take a photo in the garden. Oh, maybe... I, I did do that. Or oh, I can try to take another photo. Too distant, out of focus, properly exposed. Oh, was I meant to, like, get all that to go away? Show the adjustment panel. In focus. Now the photo's good. I've taken the picture. Now it's oh my god. So I didn't... Mm, I was meant to follow the things on the left. Did it tell me that? And I just wasn't like focusing. A general in the German army. He used to take pictures on the front lines. But now he gives me the materials to take photographs instead. Now that Martha is gone. Only this camera can fix my ideas and my memories. Yeah, yeah. I like I know how to do this. I've already gone through the tutorial. Right, let's skip that. Um, how do we scrap a photo? Well, we gotta develop this one anyway. So we got that part, and now just enlargement about here. Let's back out of focus. There we go. Expose paper. So we can just skip all that. Now wait till it gets in the green, and we'll do it. And bada bing, bada boom. I'll definitely keep this one. 
not a bad photograph. It seems that the camera works perfectly. Now mm -hmm. we can take a self-timed photo for Martha's frame. Put in the album. The high roof vent. Auto save. Huh. So now we're taking a picture of Martha. I must put one of my photos in this empty frame. I always said it to Martha I would. Alright, so we're going to take a photo of ourselves. Well, I'm actually going to end this one here. Well, I'm going to end this one here. Uh, it's a bit of a slow start to the game, which is fine. I heard a few technical issues, I think, with like... There might have been a bit of screen tearing, but I was trying to fix it. But if I did, it brought up these black bar things that just flick on the screen. I don't know. I'll see if I can get it all fixed for the next one. But it's an interesting game so far. Seems like there's actually going to be a fair bit to do in this game. Walking around, taking photos, doing stuff, follow the story, figure out... I don't really know where the story is headed. Obviously, we're pretending to be Martha, and we're not. And, yeah, not really sure, but I guess we'll figure it out in, next, in the next one. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode.